Nearly 1 billion people in the developing world do not have access to clean water. And in Africa alone, about 40 billion hours annually are spent searching for water. Who does the searching? It's mainly women and children. I want to tell you a little bit about an organization called FACE Africa. FACE Africa was founded six years ago by a Liberian-American social entrepreneur, Saran Kaba Jones. Saran is an amazing, inspiring woman, and I'm proud to call her a friend. FACE Africa provides clean water to thousands of people in Liberia. This coming Saturday, March 22nd, we are raising $250,000 to provide clean water for an additional 12,000 people in River Cess County in Liberia. By 2017, Face Africa will have 250 projects in Liberia, servicing 100,000 people and 100% water coverage in River Cess County. I look forward to seeing how Face Africa grows, how it expands throughout the entire country of Liberia, which is only about 3.9 million people, and expands throughout West Africa and hopefully throughout the entire continent. It is important that we focus on these basic issues such as clean water. Without access to services like clean water, health, sanitation, education, and so on, you can't begin to talk about building advanced economies. You cannot begin to talk about building advanced democracies. Unfortunately, when we think of Liberia, we think of conflict, and it's, of, and it's often associated with either blood diamonds or with Charles Taylor or the next thing over. We don't think about the amazing things that are happening in Liberia and throughout the entire continent. But I want you to attend Face Africa's gala on Saturday, March 22nd. See for yourself the amazing work that Saran and her team are doing, and donate whatever you can to expand their work. Clean water is important. It is obviously important for the sanitation and health reasons, but also for income and for education reasons. When women and children are spending nearly 40 billion hours annually looking for water, that's a crisis. They should be spending those hours either in school or at work. They should be using those hours to advance their lives, not searching for water that is contaminated already. And Saran and her team are looking to solve this water crisis issue in Liberia. And I want you to support, and I want you to do whatever you can. So please visit faceafricagala.com to purchase a ticket today to attend their gala on March 22nd in New York City. If you cannot attend, please consider making a tax-deductible donation by visiting faceafrica.org and learning more about their work and making a donation, no matter how small or how big, it all matters.